Hi there, greetings, greetings. Welcome into the reading. Thank you so much for tuning in. I hope that all is well with you. So these messages are love messages, um, specifically for Zodiac sign, Cancerian. And, you know, take the messages that apply for you. View these messages like your entertainment. Uh, you may find some that can inspire you on your journey. I thank you for liking the video, for sharing the message, for being a subscriber, and for leaving your beautiful comments on the channel. Okay, so, yeah. Let's get into your messages of love for today. So on this six of cups is on the bottom of the deck. I hear ranging. Uh six of cups is self-love energy. I feel like you've been taking care of yourself. Yeah, like you've been doing well. In spite of in spite of the um the odds against you, in spite of the stress and the strain, in spite of the humiliation and the disgrace and the des desperate energies, in spite of the um karmic vibrations in spite of all that was thrown at you on your back all of that like ten of wands energy right nine of wands and the seven of diamonds in spite of all the waiting and the the, the backbiting and all of those unscrupulous energies you've been really taking care of yourself for real like because uh, I feel like a lot of people eat at themselves, but you've been really taking care to take care of you, and that is really good. I also feel like I hear monumentous. There's something about your dream or someone from your dream that is coming true. Wow. You are one of a kind. You are truly a beautiful spirit. There's no other like you. Like, for real. Um, You're like a soft, divine spirit. You're a divine feminine or a divine masculine all right hit the like button i feel like people cannot program you i hear skelly skeleton there was someone that wanted your time this is someone from your past they think that they're smarter than you or whatever um so i have the four of ones which is saying there's a love connection that is being manifested for you so I'm getting the energy where someone may feel like they can't wait to sit down and talk with you for a minute and like go, maybe go somewhere and take a walk with you. Okay, yeah, the four of wands energy. Someone may even be thinking of coming to you with an offer of marriage. Uh -huh, okay. And this is, like I say, beautiful energy. This is happening because you've been really caring for yourself. And it's been showing on you for real. So other people are thinking, especially in this time when a lot of people need love and healing and inner standing, people are seeing that you are the type of person that you are really genuinely caring, nurturing. You are a healer. You have what it takes because you just look like you're, you're, you just look happy from inside out. Six of Cups energy, right? So there are people that are really attracted to that energy, people um, that really want that, what you're offering. So I feel you're getting a lot of attention, okay, um, from people that see you with real eyes, real true love. <laughs> okay, so let's see. Your first card is the temperance, because you're an earth angel, but they did it. They don't know. Like, these people don't know that it is because you're an earth angel. You've been cleaning up energy. That's what you do. That is why you bring so much light. People see you walking. I promise you, people want to call you an angel. It's not just you, but you have this light, beautiful energy that you walk around with. It's so attractive. It's magnetic. It's mesmerizing. It's like watching an angel walk down the street, except you're not wearing wings. But there's this aura about you. You're so delightful. You're so refreshing. You, When you walk um, around, you turn heads Okay, with delight. You turn heads with delight. Okay, that's what I'm getting. I hear, of course. But the thing is that people don't really know that you're an earth angel, that you've been doing so much healing on earth because you've been through so much. You've been through the ten. Oh my gosh. Something about your dreams. I promise you, you're going to be wealthy if you're not already wealthy, rich, 
successful like you're living your dream life especially when it comes to your money and your good high vibrational relationships i just want to tell you that right now you are prophetic i hear prophecy you're speaking you are an angel you speak things into life you speak things into being that is why people want to be with you so if you're interested in magic and manifestations there are people that want to collaborate with you you are literally like a beautiful lighthouse fairy that is full of potential and everyone wants one everyone wants one like you this is the energy i'm feeling like especially those that can see the realness of you that you will change their life if people are seeing that you will change their life for the better because you look like you keep working on yourself you keep well you look like you you leave people with good energies you know what i'm saying people bask in your glow but they don't know what you've been through they don't know you're an earth angel just cleaning up vibes because you've been through so much you've been through the ten of wands and the ten of swords here it is you've been down that's a song. Some yeah, the, the corn, the corn, the corn, the car horn. Who would think is a confirmation, and that is an alliteration or a tongue twister or something. Like you're out of this world. Also, you may be relocating to a place that you've been before, because I'm getting deja vu energy, right? With that, you living your dream life energy. It's like it's like too good to be true, or your dream is coming true. Something feels like you're you're here for real, okay? Right, so you've been through a lot. You know what pain feels like. And so you've done a lot of your healing yourself. That is why you walk so light and beautiful. Because you've done a lot of shadow work. So this is why people are seeing that you are an energy that can they can put their trust in. They can put their emotion in and you will help them to feel better. People are seeing you as a divine healer. A healer. And this person want to call you. We have the ten of diamonds. I'm telling you, your life is not the same as what you thought. That old mindset of you not being worthy, you not being enough, you're gonna no, you're gonna fly. People are you're gonna start believing is the energy. You're starting to believe in your magic, believe in your gifts, believe that you're unique, you're one of a kind, you're a delight to behold. Someone wants to put a ring on it. Someone wants to capture you. Someone wants you to make you their wife. I'm telling you, their person, their mate. Maybe even forever. Okay? Someone wants to like build a relationship with you. A real relationship. Committed relationship. Long lasting. Someone wants to know if you're into it. But you may be laughing or you may not be taking this person seriously. And maybe you've had multiple offers like this. Cancerian that you don't really take seriously. All right, but there's someone coming around. Yeah, page of swords. I hear daddy or father. This person is watching you. Um, you may your father's name may be important. This person may be saying your name. They may they're really watching you. They're really calling you. You're getting a lot of attention. I hear black male. Um, with the judge, with the judge, <laughs> the magician, five of swords, and the page of swords. Someone was trying to block you, magician. Someone was trying to like tell lies on you, eight of swords, or tell you lies, but I feel like you are protected. Someone may have been trying with your energy, but you are like a high priestess and you have energies protecting you. You have bodyguards, so people can't just access your energy like that. They have to go through a security system um, before they can come at you. But I do feel like someone may have tried to approach you or to get close to you. But you were protected. This person, I'm telling you, someone wants to call you. Look, look, look at this card. Twin flame. I hear in the bushes. Whoa. This person is having wild thoughts of you. Okay, dreams of you. This is the devil card. I'm seeing this could be something karmic or it could be really bad. You know what I'm saying? But it's good. You know that one? That's something like that. Um, because someone just cannot stop thinking about you. This could be someone you work with, and this person, <laughs> they really want to work with you. I feel like this person, they may be a teacher, or maybe you are a teacher, or someone is a doctor, or a nurse, or here cabinet, um, or a speaker, or a watcher, or someone may work online, or on television, or in broadcasting, or something like this, right? Mm hmm. 
There's something about money in your love reading, so let's see. Angels, spirits, guides, what is the money energy in Cancer's love reading? Knight of Wands and the Devil card. We also have the Chariot. What is this? I hear brief things or brief things. Two of Cups and the Seven of Swords and the Lovers card. I hear candle or candlelight. King of Diamonds. What is this? Maybe someone wants to ask you out on a date, but I'm not certain. I get. I, I was. I just heard yes. Um, but I'm not. But it's saying I'm not sure why you're not certain. <laughs> so, I guess you may not be ready, or someone, some part of you may not be ready for love, or you're just not aware that you're getting all of this attention and people are really thinking about you like this. But you're going to find out. I feel like you're going to find out. Oh my God, look, the three of ones repeated just the same time. What's been keeping you blocked? Or what have you been waiting for? Six of cups. So, six of cups repeated also here. So, you've been waiting for a true love or your self-love. But I feel like you found it. And someone has been waiting for you. And they've been watching you. Maybe you blocked someone, yeah. Ten of Swords and, and something about your dreams. Beautiful. So look into your dreams. Maybe you've, you've been feeling like you're not remembering your dreams or your dreams blocking. Or someone is trying to block your dreams because they don't want you to meet the person of your dreams or to fulfill your dreams in love. We did see the Magician card. So let's explore that a little. Yes, yes. So the Sun card and the Three of Cups, the Hierophant and the Justice card. For sure, I'm not lying. Uh, it could be a mother or someone from your past, Pisces energy. This could be a spiritual person. I hear folklore, John, John, John the Baptist or something. The star card. The star card is dreams and destiny. So it's a destiny. They wanted to, the death card, they wanted to reverse it or for you to not wake up. Strength card. Someone sneezed. I had a vision the other day, though, that courage is what is going to be taking, taken to um, overcome what we're going through. And the King of Wands, I feel like you are courageous. You may have um, made a huge change in life from someone that was trying, someone that was used to having their way, did not have their way with you. Yeah. All right. So let's move back into the four of, four of Wands. I'm telling you. What you've been standing here waiting for, three of ones you're getting. Some of you, you're getting a baby. Something is promised unto you. This person, I hear a glee or a glitch or it's reminding me of like high school musical kind of love. So this could be someone you go to school with or work with. So the four of ones is chemistry. But there's a blockage, maybe I hear police or something that someone said. Or maybe another, yeah, Queen of Diamonds and Queen of Cups. There's another, like, feminine or another masculine. There is a third party. There's some third party energies here. That is why you're giving so much of your attention to yourself. Because some things are just not clear. Magician. And with this magician energy, there's someone that really wants you. Someone is really trying to manifest this love with you, a love connection for real. Someone is trying to bring it true. Someone is somehow trying to be the person of your dreams by imagine someone going into someone's dreams and trying to replace certain details so it, it the person of your dreams becomes them. So someone has been like playing with you energetically. Oh my gosh! The magician and the page of wands. Energetic. Someone has been energetically um, toying or at least they were trying but they're blocked because now you are aware of yourself you're like like I say literally cleaning up energy so some of the ways that this person could target you is um, certain weak fences that you had uh, maybe brought up um, manifested in yourself because of childhood experiences so because you keep working on yourself that's why we started out with saying You've been working on yourself despite the amount of magic and all this, the chaos that's been thrown against you. You've been doing a lot of good work on yourself, beautiful soul. Alright, because someone is watching over you and seeing that someone is paying attention to you. 
um, you may be really alone or you spend a lot of time alone or you spend a lot of time just working on yourself. Someone is seeing how you're caring for yourself. No, it's really being taken, it's taking notice of and it, it's not just the Almighty Most High that is seeing it. It's, it's the eyes of God even in people in your surroundings. Right? And there are people that can see that something was wrong, something was up. So, I don't know. Let's shuffle a little bit again for the Magician card. Yeah, the Devil card that was coming up, okay? And I'm getting, someone was trying to put something onto you, but it's going onto them. Because <sighs> you're so high vibrational so protected right but don't take that for granted either so this person may be trying to pay their dues or something let's see oh my god definitely spells going on here with the high priestess this person they've also been talking about you to someone maybe like to someone in the dark i hear dark series dark net Nine of Wands, Paul or Paulipal or Polistal, Apostle. You should probably read something from the Bible to protect yourself. No weapons formed against your energy prospers. Right? Oh, that's what I'm seeing. Yeah, look, they were sending. You see all these active arrows? They're like active. It's like something has been issued. Um, so, hmm, and someone thought that you would be the easy target because they thought that you had these weaknesses in you. They thought that you'd be easily triggered, that you would attract the bad energies, you'd attract the karmic energies to you because, like, they sort of set it in motion, magician. And this has been happening for a long time, all right, since maybe your youth, this has been going on. That is why this whole truth is coming out. It's been 17 minutes we're talking about this. And I'm not even feeling tired. You're also supposed to get some money. And I feel justice and I feel the police involved as well. Look, eight of swords. And someone has been lying and, and like keeping the trying to keep the truth down. Someone was sellout too. Ace of cups. But you are speaking the truth. You you speak nothing but the truth right oh my gosh i do not play you see what i'm talking about the ace of swords you speak nothing i know i believe everything i say right maybe you should start believing in yourself more and protect yourself the ace of swords like i'm feeling like you speak nothing but the truth and there's someone this is the magician this is the someone that has been trying to plague you in some way Maybe someone you do business with or someone that was waiting for you in some way. Let's see. Three of cups. Maybe someone from your past. Could be a family member. Could be an ex. A strong ex energy too. Three of swords. Three of cups. Right? But they didn't want you to believe in yourself. They were going to stand there and hold. Like persist. And then um, hold. Like activate the, the targeting. But they thought you would only be guessing and spelling about it. So when you drop your guard, it would affect you. So it's like they didn't, they didn't think you would continue defending and protecting yourself or continue speaking up. Right? This manipulative person that <laughs> you are just speaking pure truth. You're just speaking truth out there. And it's like affecting the power that this magic was having over you. This could have been affecting your money and your love life. All right. Your, yeah, for sure. Your movement. You may have been feeling stuck like six of swords, but you're going to be having movements. Cancerian. You're moving away. You're, you're going to be having what you want. This love, this peace, this joy, harmony, union, yin, yang, happiness, freedom. You're going to be set free or you already are right complete liberation and freedom 
like you, the, the energy of paying your dues completely or no one anything cutting ties you're cutting ties and you can celebrate beautifully moving into a new union not even not afraid of anything back because there's nothing really behind you you're changing you're healing the whole of your past that's the energy that's how it looks like when a spell is broken everything else is transformed along with it a spell is broken and there's someone that knows that about you but they're still trying to hold face you see them standing here they're still trying to hold face as if what i'm delivering is not the truth they're still there trying to pretend as if my delivery is not the truth they're not telling me no they're right at this point they're not if they're not you may not even be speaking with this person they may not be denying it they may not be affirming it but because you keep affirming you keep speaking you keep blocking you keep um protecting your energies you keep healing you keep connecting to source you know you keep remaining firm this person is they were thinking that maybe soon you're gonna break maybe what you're doing is a farce is a pretense you're gonna like for surely they're gonna hold out because maybe the magic will work maybe the manipulation will work maybe you're not seeing the truth for real this person may be desperate right now i'm not sure because they're not really they're not really trying to show it let's look at the last card king of cups but you are sure you are for sure for sure imagine this is a competition endurance who can endure the most you you know why you're going to endure because like i was saying earlier these people see you and don't know what you've been through so whatever gifts you have you've um you've earned because you've been through so much i told you the ten of ones these people like you've been through so much to be where you are so you you are tough you're strong you've overcome a lot so you've put your back into it you know how to endure you know how to hold it that's why i'm saying they couldn't trigger you like they thought because you don't give up easy you don't sell out easy you don't switch easy and you know who you are yeah the sun card so they can't fool you everything you're good at it is endurance so let's see what who shall last what is the truth because love is love is right listen more to the tunes they use to misuse to confuse you don't tune you t like sheep you tune to you know like they say love is the evidence love is love is the presence love is the ma in manifestation of all things so you know what side you're standing on high priestess ace of swords and the king of cups whether this person want to believe where you stand or not, you know what you are standing on. You know what you are manifesting. These people will be diminished or they will be vaporized or they will be brought to nothingness. The more you keep believing in yourself, affirming yourself, working on yourself, there is no power on earth that is greater than love. And someone is realizing that. Someone is coming to realize that right so you keep look, working out yourself looking out for you like i said in the beginning your angels are feeling like wow through all that you've been through and you're taking care of yourself your enemies are saying the same thing all that they're you're going through and you still take care of yourself you wash you cook you clean you eat you greet you meet you get your sun you get your water and this is not bragging because some people may look at this and think, hmm, like your enemies, for example, and think, hmm, she have it easy, even though they know you don't. Because you, the ten of wands is you alone holding all of those burdens by yourself. And they're like, even though you're going through all of that, your angels are saying, you're doing beautifully well, earth angel. You're doing well. Like, make your heart be at ease and at rest and feel love and comfort within yourself knowing that we see you we watch over you we protect you and we're bringing in for you the right people in the right places in the right time and i love you you're much loved you're so protected all is well and all is within you and i'll catch you in the next one thanks for all of your show of support on the journey